Do you think your hair can't get any thicker? Think again. Henna is the unparalleled powerhouse of hair care, instantly thickening each strand upon contact. This remarkable herb doesn't just stop at preventing breakage. It transforms your hair, smoothing the cuticle, infusing a supernatural shine, and stimulating astonishing growth. Today, I'm not just going to introduce you to the miracle that is henna, I'm going to reveal the ultimate henna recipe that unlocks its full potential. You'll learn the precise application techniques to maximize its instant thickening power and stimulate incredible growth. Plus, stay tuned till the end for some exclusive tips on how to amplify henna's remarkable effects. Get ready to witness a transformation that will make you rethink everything you thought you knew about hair care. If you're as excited as I am, let's not waste any more time. Let's get into this video. But of course, before we do, please be sure to thumbs up and let YouTube know you enjoy this type of content. Be sure to comment down below. Be sure to share this video with your friends and your loved ones. And last but never ever can be least, be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications so you know every time I post a new video. Now, without further ado, let's get right into the video and don't skip those ads so I can keep these videos free and sustainable just for you. Get ready to add some creativity to your hair routine with this very exclusive recipe from my DIY hair book that's extremely popular, FXR's Recipe Bible. Access it very easily by clicking the link in the top right corner or the description box down below. The myriad of benefits offered by henna is nothing short of astonishing. Henna known scientifically as Lawsonia inermis, is a shrub-like flowering plant that produces a thick paste when mixed with water. This paste is then used as a natural hair dye and conditioner, as well as to enhance the strength and shine of hair. Henna has been used for centuries to nourish and protect the natural 4A, 4B, 4C <laughs> hair from environmental factors such as sun exposure and pollution. Its ability to thicken and strengthen hair has resulted in the plant being venerated for its potential to improve hair health. Recent studies have also shown that henna can be used to promote the regrowth of thinning or damaged hair. The active ingredient behind these benefits is lawson, which binds itself to keratin proteins found in our scalp and hair follicles. This thickening effect helps protect the cuticle layer of our strands from further damage, while also adding volume and texture. Henna's conditioning properties can also provide relief from dry scalp conditions, such as dandruff and psoriasis, by promoting healthy sebum production without clogging pores or causing irritation. Additional studies suggest that henna may also help improve circulation on the scalp, which can encourage healthy growth patterns for those who experience balding or thinning due to genetic predisposition or other medical issues. Beyond these obvious physical benefits, henna can also be used safely on chemically treated locks <laughs> without fear of damaging them further, providing an all-natural alternative to harsh chemical treatments, often prescribed by dermatologists and stylists alike. Henna has even been credited with helping treat skin ailments such as fungal infections, eczema, and more due to their antiseptic properties, which make it highly effective when used topically. When selecting a henna product, it is important to purchase one that contains 100% pure ingredients, free from chemicals such as ammonia or peroxide, both of which could be damaging if left on too long during application, especially if combined with artificial colors or fragrances. Additionally, always perform a patch test before performing an all-over treatment. Some people may experience an allergic reaction when exposed directly to the plant. Ultimately, henna offers tangible benefits when applied properly. It's a straightforward solution for those who want to get healthier looking hair with more fullness and luster. It's not difficult to understand why this miraculous plant is so popular around the world for improving hair health as it offers amazing benefits at an incredibly affordable cost 
compared to the plethora of treatments on the market today. So y'all, let's do what we normally do and let's make this recipe. Now, of course, we're starting with our trusty Westy Henna. Next, we're moving on to our Amla powder. Following that, we're adding aloe vera. Now this adds extra moisture. And then our lavender, which actually has the potential to increase the amount of hair follicles on your head. And of course, I'm grinding that up in my little coffee grinder. As you know, this is one of the brilliant recipes from my recipe Bible, which is on sale for 20% off. Be sure to check it out in the top right corner. Now, normally I use a tea to prepare my henna. I tend to use green tea, but I wanted an extra boost. So I opted to use Moringa today. Now with my water, I'm bringing it to a boil. And as soon as it starts rolling, I remove it from the stove top. Here's my Moringa Tisan. Now I'm adding only four packets to my roughly 500 milliliters of water. After allowing that to steep until the water is room temperature, I gradually add water to the mixture. As you can see, I'm stirring as I'm adding. I take my time, mix it up a bit, and I keep adding until I get the consistency that I want. Now I like a nice paste, not too thick, not too runny. I want something that's easily going to spread across my hair. I also need to be able to reach my scalp because all of these ingredients are not only nourishing the hair and fortifying the hair strand, they're also nourishing the scalp and encouraging massive hair growth. But you're going to leave this mixture for about three to eight hours. As long as it takes for the dye to release is however long you're going to leave it. You're just going to cover it with foil or saran wrap. Great, so now let's let that sit for the allotted time and we're going to move on to the application. Are you tired of using chemical laden products that harm your locks? Are you looking for a natural and healthy solution for your hair? Look no further, FXR's Recipe Bible is here to save the day. This book contains not just one, but multiple henna hair mask recipes that will give your hair the love and nourishment that it truly deserves. Each recipe has been tried and tested by yours truly. And I can assure you, the results will leave you in awe. Say goodbye to dry, frizzy, and damaged hair, and say hello to soft, luscious, and shiny locks. This book is not just a hair care guide, it's a love letter to your hair. I've put my heart and soul into creating these recipes to give you the best hair care experience. Trust me, your hair will thank you for this. So go ahead and invest in yourself and your hair. Get your hands on FXR's Recipe Bible today and join me on this beautiful natural hair care journey. You will never, ever regret it. I promise. Love and healthy hair always. Here are some of my favorite reviews. Be sure to pause to read them. They'll give you hope that you never thought you could have. If you want your dollar to stretch a little bit farther, then be sure to check out my hair growth bundle, which includes every single digital product in my digital store. The best thing about this bundle is that you get a product that's going to address every part of your hair growth journey. And beyond that, you have access to free updates at this exclusive price. When these products reach their final iterations or when this bundle is updated, it will only become more expensive. So the best time to buy it is now. As you can see, it's a $145 value for $94.25. And if you've been here for a long time, then you know the two new additions to this bundle are my scalp compendium, which is a 160,000 plus word comprehensive manual and guide on the scalp. And beyond that, we have my oil renaissance, which is a comprehensive manual explaining the necessity of oils, delineating the difference between hydration and moisturization, and so much more. So be sure to get my bundle and revolutionize your hair care today. Yay, so it's application time. So the first things first, I need to put on my gloves because henna 
responds to keratin and you have keratin in your nails. It will also stain your skin. Now, I like to do this in twisted sections. And as you can see, I've just pulled out one twist and I'm applying the henna first to the mid shaft to the ends. That's going to help stretch out my hair. And then I'm going to get closer and closer to the root, gently applying it and making sure that I'm touching every area of my scalp. As you can see, I'm smoothing it downward. And wow, my hair's kind of long, y'all. It's getting pretty long. After I've smoothed it in, I make sure to twist my hair back up to keep everything nice and organized. Now, please note, I didn't like scrunch it in. I smoothed it in. The only place that I rub a bit is on my scalp, as you can see in this next section. Again, this is to ensure that it touches every part of my roots, but I make sure I use a generous amount so that I don't have to cause harm or damage to my hair as I'm doing this process. And of course, I'm twisting this section back up. Now we're on to the next section. I've already smoothed the henna in. I'm really just showing you guys my length because my hair is bussin. And this was a few months ago, so my hair is actually like a lot longer now. And I'm super excited. Can't wait to show you guys the new length close to my birthday. If you know my birthday, comment down below and drop some purple emojis because I'm a princess, period. <laughs> and we're actually getting to like the last few sections. Oh, we're finished. Oh. Oh, movie magic, we're done. So this is what my hair looks like with the henna fully applied. Now I'm extra, so I like to leave this on for about eight hours. You really don't have to, especially if you're using a high quality henna, which you might be seeing from me sooner rather than later. Turn on notifications, subscribe. <laughs> but yeah, I just cover with two plastic bags because shower caps don't fit my big head and my voluminous hair. And then I tie my do-rag and then I used my turban that I got in the Nigerian market. 24 hours later. Now, of course, 24 hours later, I've already rinsed this out of my hair. Now, I haven't applied any product yet because it's advisable to avoid using products so that the henna actually has time to oxidize and really set into the hair. Until then, my hair is probably just going to be chilling underneath the turban. But of course, I don't want to go more than 48 hours without applying product. And that would be my advice to you. But following this, you should already notice that your hair is much thicker, super rigid and full. So if you all want to see one of the ways in which I actually removed the henna from my hair and also see what my hair looked like long ago when I first started using henna, then be sure to check out this video here. It's going to be linked in the top right corner for your convenience. Please open it up in another window so that you can watch it after watching this video. Wow, if you've made it this far, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. God bless you. I love you so much. And I can't wait to see you in the next video. Please drop some blue emojis down below. You already know the drill. And comment, I love my hair and I'm going to try this henna mask. If you are, let me know what other masks you've tried and please share your hair stories with me. You know, the comment section is the place where I really get to interact with you. And I'd love to hear from you. Thank you once again. I love you so much. And I will see you in my next video. Ta-ta for now.